Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q3 of the Weekly Contest 328. Count the number of good supper ways. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about this poem. So this one, I, ma I made a silly mistake and it came up with wrong answer. And I kind of spent a long time debugging it. Um, I just kind of understood it a little bit wrong. I read it correctly, but I understood it a little bit incorrectly. Um, but yeah, so definitely hit the love button, hit the subscribe button, um, and let me know what you think about this one in general. But but basically, the um, and this is kind of really hard for me, to be honest, um, and the idea is sliding window. Um, and basically, the idea about this sliding window, and I'm going to do ask it all, um, is just that, and the part of this that requires math, so this is kind of a hard cue to read, if you ask me, but I don't know, maybe everything's just getting harder, and I'm just complaining like the old guy or something. Um, but yeah, but maybe we could, uh, let's just even combine them, right? Why not? And then you have some, we'll go over it, right? And then the idea here is, um, and it's not actually that bad, but you have to know a little bit of math and making observations. Um, but the idea here is that, okay, let's say we have some uh, substring, right? Or subarray, sorry. Um, keeping in mind that now um, we have three ones and okay, let's just make it maybe say uh, five ones, right? Um, if we have five ones, that's equal to, um, what is it, five choose two pairs, right? So that's five times four over two or something like that, right? So you have to kind of figure out how to uh, do it in a good way. So it's one plus two plus three plus four, which is equal to ten, right? Um, so that's basically the idea uh, about getting a subarray and then, and then making sure that it is bigger than k, or yeah, k is the input name, right? Okay, so now with that piece in mind, because I think that's the part that I had to make sure, um, then it just becomes sliding window because then now, um, th what are we sliding windows on, right? Sliding window or left, right thing. Um, let's say, uh, let's say K is equal to two, right? Then now as we slide, we don't have two pairs until we hit, hit here. So then what does that mean? That means that, okay, this we know have two pairs. And what does that additionally mean, right? It means that there's one good subarray, right? Okay, one good subarray. And then now we want to move the left until it doesn't have a subarray. And why do I do that? Well, well, we'll show you in a second. But now we have one subarray or one good array or one good subarray and and a, and a, um, and a subarray that doesn't have it, right? And then now let's say we go to the four. Okay, now we extend to the four. Okay, now we have two pairs again. That's good. How many subarrays are there? Well, let's keep on removing stuff until we can't anymore, right? So then now we remove stuff until we can't anymore. And then now, we, what does this mean? Well, we can't have any more subarrays, or this is no longer good when we're here. What does that mean? That means that um, if we extend this to the left here, to this four, that's good, right? So that's one. And then if we also extend it to the left to do add the one, it also is good, right? Of course it's good because now, because the good array, if you will, because if you think about the good array is here, I'm just going to write G, I'm doing this. Um, if you combine this all the way up to here, this contains the good array, uh, good subarray. So of course it is also a good subarray in itself, right? And then you do the same thing from here, right? So then the answer is two. Okay. And then now, okay, let's slide to the right. Rep one doesn't do anything, I think. Yeah. And then another one. And then now we slide, slide, slide uh, on the on the sliding window. And then now we, this is the first thing where you chopped off the left until it's good again, or, or it's not good again. And what does that mean? That means that if we extend to the left. This is good. Um, this is good. This is good, and this is good, right? Uh, I actually. And this is actually something that I messed up, so I messed up in an explanation as well. But so that for this one, there's uh, five of these, right? Or something like this. Uh, it doesn't really matter, right? Uh, uh, yeah, there's five of these going this way, right? But I actually skipped one, uh, some things, which is that let's go back for a second. So we had, you know, this thing, right? Um, and then the idea is that, okay, now we extend the one. And actually, it's funny because that is literally how I got the wrong answer. But extending the one, um, extending the one, what does that mean? Well, it still means that these three, there are three good subarrays, right? Because, 
because that contains the four, that contains the one, and this contains the three. Um, it still has all the, the pairs, right? Because, you know, uh, the previous known good subarray is here. So then now we know that starting from one, if we include here, that's one, include here, that's two, include here, that's three, and so forth, right? So basically now you have to add in another three, another three for the second one, or maybe not the second one. But yeah, but then now at the end, you just sum everything up and that's, there you go. So that's basically the visualization, and that's where the sliding window comes from. And uh, as I said, I kind of missed, we misunderstood some part of it because this is kind of a tricky one, if you ask me. And I took a long time debugging. And you could watch me solve it live next during that portion where you, uh, also this is why this thing is here, even though it doesn't do anything um, anymore because I had the wrong answer. But, but yeah, but basically here we keep track it's a lot of keeping track. This is the answer. This is the left part of the supper, uh, the sliding window. This is the count of everything that we have inside the sliding window. And this is the number of pairs that are inside the sliding window. And you can kind of calculate this way. Um, you add it to the previous count because if we add in this number X, you can make the number of things you've seen before, so that adds the number of pairs, and then you add one to the number of count, and then here it's just sliding left to kind of get rid until we get out of the window, and then we, yeah, and then we subtract it from as we slide through the window, and then we moving the number of pairs that it was connected to, and then just slide, and then at the end we left is kind of uh, the number of subarrays that we've seen that are good uh, on the left side, so yeah. And that's pretty much it. This is going to be a linear time, linear space. This is the linear time. Oh, sorry. This is the linear space, but this is the linear time. And yeah, and even though there's a while in there, you can think about, you know, as a sliding window, it can only slide left 10 uh, n times and slide right n times. So it's going to be linear time at total. So yeah, linear time, linear space. And that's all I have for this one. Let me know. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> uh, let me know what you think, and you could watch me solve a live contest next, including all the typos and mistakes. Now. That one's hard. Um, maybe. Let's do it optimally anyway. I think C++, some people might just do it the half-cheating way. What's a good way? I'm so tilted by that one. K pairs of index such that, okay. Number of good subarrays. <coughs> Two pairs. Wow, oh, people got it really quickly. Oh, two. That's actually kind of how do you feel so quickly? Hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Some prefix thing, right? Sliding window, maybe. This one's a hard contest, to be honest. Oops. Okay. 
No. What does that do? So if this is two, then four. This and then now it's all like Something like that, but maybe I'm off by one on the left. Hmm. It would be nice if you increment. Hmm. Maybe I'm wrong on this one. I don't. I wasn't sure about this one, to be honest. on this one so I'm missing some oh I'm just doing it the wrong way <clears throat> 18 This part I was always a little bit weird about. No, that's not right either, so. Hmm. This one has two. Why is that? Thirteen hmm. pairs. Okay. Is it thirteen pairs though? Did I mess it up? Up to ten, we have six trees. Six three should be fifteen by itself. Oh, well, it only adds six. Oh, and then the two also adds left. <clears throat> Because now, oh man, what a silly mistake. Oh, I, I wasn't sure about that one actually. 
So maybe that's fine. Hmm. Huh, okay. Yeah, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about these problems and this problem and the explanation. Uh, stay good, stay healthy, to good mental health. I'll see you later and take care. Bye-bye.